This has got to be her. Yeah. Mm. How you doing? I'm Neve. Hi. Hi. Of course, you know CJ. But we don't know who you are. Rebecca. Rebecca. Okay, nice to finally meet you. Do you want to explain what's going on here? I don't, I don't even know where to start. What, what's your deal? I, I mean, what of Shayna is true, what's not true, who, who are you? I think Shayna, as a general person, that's really who I am. Yeah, maybe the personality. But, yeah. I got a question. So this whole time you was in Syracuse? Yeah. Why did you tell me that you live in New Jersey? I made up, like, New Jersey and other places I lived to try to, like, get away from the situation because I felt bad. How did you keep it for, like, eight years, like? Just didn't tell anybody. So if you if you never had any intentions on meeting him, what was the point of all of this? I, I, honestly, I don't know. I had a lot of, when I made the Facebook, I was in a situation, um, trying to catch the person I was with cheating. So I made the Facebook to do that. That's how I ended up talking to CJ. How did you get all those pictures, though? Some girl that was friends with my son on Facebook. Oh, how many kids do you have? Five. Wow. Do you really have a daughter? I do. I call her Was she really sick and stuff? No. So you set up a GoFundMe page for a daughter with I fake did. cancer. That's, That's sick. seriously sick. Were you? I think I was just, I was trying to cover the lie that I had told him. I wasn't, I didn't have like, it wasn't, oh, well, I'm just gonna rob people of their money. It was another lie to cover another lie to cover another lie. Who was Destiny? Me. Hmm, are you serious? Why did you tell me that you died? I just, like, I really just wanted to be done with the situation. I didn't want to keep lying. But then I felt bad because you were really hurt over. But then you started talking to other people as Destiny. And obviously continued talking as Shayna, too, because we reached out to a handful of people on Shayna's Facebook page, and most of them have a very similar story as to CJ. Mm -hmm. If if you'd done it to one person, you you maybe could say you felt bad. But to see that you've been doing it to, I don't even know how many. I mean, do you even know how many people you've talked to as her? No, mo most of them, minus CJ, was more or less to just keep, keep that image going so that people wouldn't think that it was a fake Facebook. I never took those conversations seriously. It wasn't. Well, they did take it seriously. I understand the, the original reason for making the Shannon profile was something else, but when you met CJ, was it just for fun to talk to him, or did I you? Re I really cared about, like, I really started having feelings for him. Right, but, and but he was 17, and you're not in your 20s, mm -hmm. no offense. How old are you? 38. Wow. So, OK, you were 30 when you met him. Yeah, I didn't really think about but it. But you knew he was 17 when you met him. Yeah. That's kind of messed up. Like, it's one thing to, to mess with people your own age, but, like, to mess with a kid for f eight years of his, like, young adult life? I don't know. I'm just hurt about it, like, because... I wasn't trying to hurt you. That's not true. He had girlfriends that you f with. Yeah, when I was in a relationship and stuff, and you sabotaged some of my relationships, and you was in a relationship with no, other I people, too. Some of them, You yeah. never texted or messaged any of the girls he was dating? I don't remember that. Mm, are you serious? That's, that's crazy. I gotta go for a second. Can oh. I do it for you? Why don't I do it for you? You good? After everything we've been through, eight years, I didn't think it was gonna be like this. It's eight years worth of lies. I'm hurt, honestly. Hey, okay? He's so much a part of my life. All, all my good moments, all my bad moments. When I needed somebody to talk to, he was always there. That I was just always worried that he was just gonna not be there anymore. And then I was afraid he was gonna hate me on top of that. 
And she said she didn't sabotage some of my relationships. She did. Mm -hmm. Eight years and she's doing the same, same thing, thing for other people. For everybody else, right. I feel horrible. Do you? Because I'm hearing you express feelings for yourself and not wanting him to hate you. But like, it doesn't take into account the fact that that I deceived him. Yeah. So I think, for his sake, think a little bit about him. OK. Dig a little deeper. And then let's meet back up. Yeah. All right, great. So I'll speak to you soon. All right. We're going to meet back up with her in a little bit. The right and hoping I'm not enough. We've never been two hopeless hook up. An identical twin. <gasps> Everybody in Hawaii is in on this. <gasps> That's insane. We've never seen anything like this. The catfish sent you the real guy's Facebook page. Oh. Oh.